Hello everyone. This is, I guess, week 28 of my journey. Um, the challenge is over for now, so I'm back to my regular videos. Which means this week is my seven months on YouTube. It's been a very quick seven months. That's for sure. So, I weighed in on Monday, and I weighed in at 187.4. So, that is a gain of 1.1 from last week. But I think I see where it came from. I kind of... Last weekend, I worked... We had the Saturday Sunday before my weigh-in on Monday. And on both the Saturday and Sunday, I kind of gave into temptation a bit. I bought a bag of chips on Saturday for the, for the vending machine at work, and a bag of chips on Sunday for the vending machine at work. Then Sunday night, I went and got gas, when I filled my tank, and I was at the convenience store, and I bought two bags of chips and a bag of Reese's Bites. See how that stuff I ate? All weekend was about a pound of calories, about 3,500 calories around there. So that one obviously didn't constitute where my 1.1 pound gain came from, but that's okay. Um, I understand, so it's okay with that. So today, tonight, I guess. I, so my family opens opens their presents Christmas Eve. So, I'll be opening the majority of my presents tonight. My parents usually will do, what we'll do is we'll open basically all my presents tonight. And then we'll keep, they'll keep one present to the side. And open that in the morning. The only thing I'm wondering about this year is every year in the morning it's always, we have one present and then we have like, we have three different piles. Like me and my parents, right? There's only three of us. We have three different piles around the tree. And we have... Each has their own pile, right? We have, each have one present sitting there. And then we usually have, like, chocolates and candies and all that, you know, little piles as well. And I'm hoping this year there's not as much chocolate and candies. But if there is, I'm going to make sure it lasts. If I get chocolate and candy, I'm going to... Previous years it's been, I get the chocolate and I get the candy, and it's gone in the next, like, two days. It's gone before New Year's. Guaranteed. It's gone before New Year's. Guaranteed. This year, depends how much I get. It'll last me a while. So, I'm hoping it's very little, because my mother knows that I'm cutting off the junk food a bit, but she just might bring it down a little bit, she'll, be pulling, she'll still give me some, I know that, and I'm expecting that, so, but I'm hoping it's a little bit, so, I mean, it's really interesting to find out. Um, that I will be joining the next challenge, um, Greg Ayers says, yes. I know they said they were going to throw another video up explaining more about it before the New Year's, so I'm hoping, I'm assuming it's going to be next week, they'll throw it up there. I cannot wait to find out what's up with that challenge. It's going to, it's going to be awesome. That will, that challenge will definitely help me. Um, I'm, I'm, si I'm only sitting around that, you know, five to, you know, five to ten pounds away from goal. I'm always sitting around there. I've been sitting around there for three months now. And I want to get down there, finally. But, even though I am only staying around that weight range, my, my measurements, my waist measurement is still going down. I'm slower now, but it is still going down. Because in, in 
in September, when I was when I went back to school, I weighed 187 pounds, and my waist was at I think it was about 38 inches at the beginning of September, and well, it was just about 38 inches. And right now, I weigh I measure myself I measure myself like probably twice a week. Um, I will measure myself in at 36 and a half inches. So I'm down an inch and a half since, since September. And I'm very happy with that. Um, speaking of my inches goal, my inches, I am changing my goal down to 32 inches. I originally had my goal 34 inches. My reasoning for that is my roommate hinted me on something. When I measure myself, I use this measuring tape here. Pretty long. See, there's the red zone. Oops. See, there's the red zone. It even tells you how much you know, where you want to stay out of. That's man, and that's woman. Okay. Right. But it's one side woman, one side man. Here's both sides. Um, when I measure myself, I usually take this part of my waist, and I'll go to the very end, and put this part, you know, like, for instance, when I do like this, right when I got it, like this, this would be 13 inches. But my roommate told me that apparently uh, I'm supposed to measure from that line there, which would drop it down to, you know, in this case, 12 and a half inches. That looks like 15. So, um, to, I don't, I don't want to, so I decided to lower my goal down to 32 inches based on how I measure, because if I bring it up that extra inch and a half, basically, I'll be back up to 38 inches, and I, my mindset, I don't think I could take that. I don't think I could, <coughs> I don't think I could take knowing I'm still 38 inches. So, I'm going to keep it down to where I measure it, and we'll roll my roll down to 32 inches instead of 34 to get rid of that little um, difference there. So in actuality, I'll probably be 30, I'll be 33 and a half, 34 inches in the end anyway, so it works out perfectly, for the mindset at least. Um, I will not be making a video next week. Um, I'm going to visit a friend for New Year's. We're we'll leaving, like, I'm working next week, you know, Saturday all the way to Wednesday. And then I am. Um, we're leaving early Thursday morning and coming back Friday night because I work Saturday again. And we're going out to visit him in, uh, nobody will know this place, but in Lloyd Minister right on the border of Saskatchewan and Alberta. Literally, half the towns in Alberta, half the towns in Saskatchewan. But, so we're going out there, so won't be around to make a video then. Um, but I will make a video the following week. We'll find out exactly when Justin Gregers wants your entry, entry videos in by, and I'll make a video for that too. So, in other words, this is my last video for the New Year's, for this year. Um, I'll see you all in New Year's. And I'm hoping to see a lot of you in the Barriers vs. Justice Challenge. So, numbers that we saw in Justice's Christmas vs. Challenge, I want to see more. In the end, the starting number is great. We also awesome established, but I want to see a lot more finishing the challenge than we had. And, uh, Jess, I understand you're busy, but, uh, I really like knowing the results of the challenge. <laughs> so, I'll see you all in the new year. Bye.